Hey everybody, welcome to Cooking with Karen. Uh, like I told you before, the next few videos are going to be all the salads. Summer salads, whatever. Okay, I'm going to do one of my sister's favorites, which is broccoli salad. Okay, um, let's get to the ingredients. What you're going to need is broccoli, of course, a couple heads, um, uh, cheese. They say cheddar cheese, but you know what? I don't have cheddar cheese, so I'm going to use whatever cheese I have. Um, dried cranberries. You don't have to put cranberries. You can put raisins, whatever you want in there. Blueberries, whatever. Um, I put a little celery seed in mine. You don't have to do that either. Uh, sunflower seeds or walnuts. Uh, onion, mayonnaise, vinegar, uh, sugar, bacon, and salt and pepper. Okay? I didn't bring salt and pepper up. All right, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm, I'm just going to slide this all over and I'll be right back. Okay. All right. So I just moved things around a little bit. Um, I just wanted to show you how, I'm gonna, how I do the uh, broccoli. I've already did most of it. But um, I just take the knife and I take the just around the, the flour and just cut it off like that. I don't waste anything, but, you know, if you're going to throw this away, make a soup or something with it. Um, I usually chop it up fine and put it in my salad because um, it goes good and it's and it's good. But, you know, just make sure you have bite-sized pieces. Okay. So, like I said, all, all I do is I take these little flower thing, and the, these little broccoli flowers, and then I just break them apart, little bite-sized pieces. And then, um, you know, a lot of people only eat this part of the broccoli, uh, I like it all. So, I like I said, I take the, okay, let me just throw these in, just like so. I just usually just take these and um, the bigger pieces, those little ones I don't, but, um, and I just cut them real small like this. See, let me get it. Just little bite-sized pieces. And then this way, every, you, know, you get a mouthful of broccoli. What are you gonna do? Okay, let, let's, I'm not gonna do the rest of that because I wanna show you. I have bacon and I, I wanted to show you. I take half a pound of bacon, okay? And I hate these baggies. If you're gonna buy a bag, a baggie, get the name brand for the sandwich bag because the other ones don't open all right this is froze okay and this is how i do mine i take it and i just cut lip, a strip top just like this okay now like i said you do whatever you want to do if you want to cook the whole slice of bacon and then sit there and crumble it you go right ahead but once i'm done with that Throw it in the pan, turn on the stove, and then voila, I already have my bacon done. These were the little um, pieces I just cut, okay? That was just a little something I wanted to share with you. Okay, what I'm going to do now is um, I'm going to clean up this mess a little bit. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna make the dressing, okay? I'm gonna put a couple mayonnaise. I'm gonna just gonna change the bowl because I don't know if I have enough room. Okay, I got it. Um, two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar and almost a half a cup of sugar. I should probably put the whole half a cup and maybe it'll sweeten my sister up. And then I put, you know, a pinch of celery seed in. Why? Because I like celery seed. And I think all salads should have celery. Okay. So the reason why I'm doing this is give the, the sugar a chance to dissolve before I finish everything else. And then... It's so it's nice and creamy when it goes into my salad. 
That's why I don't have all these globs of mayonnaise. Okay. So there's our dressing. I'll salt and pepper that. I won't um, salt and pepper this. Okay, now we back to here. Okay, so we're gonna put onion in. Now there's two heads of, um, there's two heads of uh, broccoli. Okay, there's um, a half a cup of onion. Can't waste the onion. Okay, half a cup of onion. And, I don't know, I'm gonna eyeball this. Um, these nuts. I'm putting nuts in because my sister's nuts. Wait a second, guys. I'm having an issue. Ah, there we go. Alright. So I'm going to probably put, oh, maybe close to half a cup. And then I'm going to put these, these guys in. These are uh, cranberries. You know, I got to admit, this is pretty good. I even like it. And I'm not a real big broccoli fan. You know what? You can put as many as you want. That's all I'm going to put in right now because I'm not sure if that's what, that, that's what I'm going to do. Or that's how many I'm going to do. I'm going to put my bacon in. And now I'm going to put salt and pepper. Just a little. If I can get the cat. Yep, there it goes. Okay. Now we're going to put our mixture in. This is how easy it is. Pour that over the top. Like so. You're gonna kill me, because I don't have a spoon to cut this. All right. She usually yells at me for moving away from the stove. The camera. Or, yeah, moving away from the camera. Okay, come on, it's eight o'clock at night. I'm tired. Hope somebody eats this. It's a lot of gas right here, let me tell you. Um, but anyways, you get the idea. There's our, there's my take on broccoli salad. Doesn't take long to make. The longest part of this salad is cooking the bacon and putting that in. Okay? Okay, guys. I almost forgot the cheese. Um, anyways, we're going to put probably, oh, that much in, okay? <laughs> probably a cup. Um, yeah, it's no more than a cup. And they say to put the big cheese in, and there's a reason for that, because the cheese kind of like gets mushy. So this is something you're going to have to eat like right away if you use that little fine stuff, which that's what I have, and that's all I have. And I'm not going to run to the store just to get a package of cheese. As you know, Mount Morris has no store, so I'd have to go to Geneseo. And uh, I'm not doing that. So, okay. Now this is done. There you guys go. My take on broccoli salad. I hope you enjoy that. And uh, I'll see you next time. Check me out on Facebook, on YouTube. Give me a like, a share, tell your friends, yell out the windows, and I'll catch you next time. Okay? Manja, manja. Have a good night. almost forget the cheese um it probably would have been just as good without the cheese but anyways manja manja enjoy that sale and i'll look forward to seeing you next time see ya